When you take a look at the map of Burundi, you will see that it looks like the human heart. That is why Burundi is called the heart of Africa. Many Africans are concerned about why they don't really hear from Burundians. People who come from Burundi, please, are you guys available? Are you around? If you come from Burundi, please, at least leave a comment on this post. Because we don't hear from you guys. We don't hear from people from who come from Burundi. Personally, I don't even know anyone who comes from Burundi. Can you imagine? Are you guys are you guys part of East Africa? So here are some of the things you need to know about Burundi and why you are likely not to see anyone from Burundi on social media. Burundi is a landlocked country located in East Central Africa, bordered by Rwanda to the north, Tanzania to the east and southeast, the Democratic Republic of Congo to the west, and also bordered by the largest freshwater lake in the world, Lake Tanganyika. Lake Tanganyika is the second oldest freshwater lake and second largest by volume and the second deepest in the world. Burundi is considered one of the poorest countries by the outside world, but its people believe they are the richest. And you and I know for the fact that Burundi is a very rich country in terms of natural resources. Now, there are two major reasons why you can't find so many Burundians online. And the first reason is the population. There are about 13 million Burundians and according to statistics, over 80% of Burundians are living a low-key beautiful village life in their underdeveloped rural areas. So because of this, the probability of people that will have access to a good phone, electricity or good internet in the rural places will be very few. The second reason is language barrier. Burundi was once a colony of Belgium and French was the language that was promoted by the colonial administration. So they speak mostly French and Kirundi as their official languages. And for example, if you speak French on social media, the algorithm will push your videos to more French speakers or people who understand your language. So as an English speaker, the probability of seeing French content will be very low. That is one of the reasons you don't see many Burundians on your FYP. In 2014, Burundian government made English the third official language because Burundi was integrated in the East African community, which is a community whose members are all from English-speaking countries. Now, this will increase the chances of more Burundians learning English language. But there are so many English-speaking Burundians online. So if you are from Burundi and you see this video, let us know in the comment section.